Fakira is trying again because Fakira she don't she never have enough. Do we have any brave Muhammad? Muhammadan? So Shaitan he tried to get close to the heaven of Allah. Allah will shoot Shaitan in his ass. Hello? I'm lying about Islam? Yep. Okay, go ahead. Why I'm lying? How I'm lying? Go ahead. I listened to you many, 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 many times. You know. All right. Yeah. What's, what, what, what's your problem? Well, what about you help us in, the, in what we are talking about? Chapter 67, verse number 5, it says that Allah, he created the stars and he put them in the lowest heaven. What is the purpose? You gonna run now? Damn no. he, he, he got a, he got he got his friend to to talk. You know what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I will let you talk. I will let you talk. Can you explain this verse? Yes. Go ahead. Any verse? Come on now. Bring it. Chapter sixty-seven, verse number five. Read it. You tell me. You are the one who claimed to be a sheikh, but you are a potato. Read it. Go ahead. Just read. Just just read it. Tell I am illiterate, like your prophet. I didn't know how to read. Go ahead, Fakira. Okay. Okay. Let me put it there. Chapter 67 said, verse 5, you said? Uh -huh. Okay. Now, now that I caught you, you can't run now. Ah, yeah, you see who was going to run. Do you remember the last, do you remember two days ago you called me, you said there's nobody give sacrifice? <laughs> Just two days ago, we gave you a spank and we left our fingers on you. Go ahead, explain, explain the verse. Chapter 67, verse 5, you said? Mm-hmm. 67? Mm-hmm. Maybe you could have made it easier, but... You know, I, I do the hard way. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Yeah. Hold on. Be sure you will download this video and put it in your channel. I challenge you. Of course. Okay, hey, go ahead. Okay. Time, okay, 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 okay. Explain the verse. Go ahead. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm putting it up. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Told you can run. You can Don't, run, you can hide. Uh, let's see who's going to run. Go ahead, I'm waiting. Don't waste my time. Why is taking your time? Are you opening your Shad Khalifa interpretation? Okay, we have... No, I'm facing the verse. I'm about to read the verse. Mm -hmm. 67 uh, verse 5. Uh -huh. We have the lowest universe with lamp, and we have made them a means to drive away the the Shaya teams. Mm -hmm. We have prepared for them a chastisement of a blazing fire. Uh -huh. So what do you want to need? Uh, what do you want to know about that? Explain to me what this verse is saying. This verse is saying that mm -hmm. the star are made uh, for you to understand everything. Any jinn that comes down here, they will try to go back up. But Allah said they cannot go past the first. They they will try to sneak in. They cannot go past the first the first uh, uh, universe, the lowest universe. So when they got there, they got bullied, got whooped, and come back down. Simple as that. Okay, then. That's it. Okay, you just said everybody heard you that the genie yeah. who tr who come down, they try to come back. The genies who came down, yes. the, when the genie come down, they try to come back, and they exactly. got and they got bullied. Go back up. Go back up, exactly. Yes. Where in the Quran it says that genies, they are coming from the sky and they try to come back. Where it says that in the verse, where it says that in the other verse. Go ahead. It tells you when uh, when uh, when Iblis, if you go to chapter chapter 18, verse 50, uh -huh. But this is one. He was among the jinns. Uh -huh. But you just say it, you just say it. So uh, when genies come down, they try to come back. They try, they, you say they. And yes. uh, and here it says, Shayateen, not one. You are quoting for me, Iblis. Iblis, Allah kicked him out from heaven a long time ago. But you just said to me, they come down, they try to go back, they got bully. And yes. Allah, he guarding the heaven by the stars, he showed stars at them, correct? Okay. All right. Where where it says that the genies, Shaitan, Shayateen, not one, not two, not three, they came down, and now they are trying to come back, and then Allah will shoot them. Go ahead. 
Yeah, I show you. I gotta Google it. But you know the verse is in the Quran. But, but you, here, you quote for me a verse about one genie. Here it says shayateen. Okay. There's only one genie. Did Shaitan have kids when Allah he sent him down? Do you have a wife like Hawa, like Adam and Hawa? Hold on. Mm -hmm. Got hit with bullet. And I don't know. You see that? It's not a big deal. It's, it's coming right now. Oh, it's coming. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Don't ha don't hang up. Hold on. <laughs> hey, go to uh, the genius and go to chapter chapter seventy two, verse eight to ten. Uh huh. Jim steal information from the sky before the message. Uh, hold on. It says, uh, read chapter chapter seventy two. Uh huh. Verse Verse eight to verse ten. Uh -huh. Chapter what? Ch uh, Eighty-two. Chapter what? Seventy-two. Seventy-two. Okay. Yeah. All right. Verse eight to verse ten. Chapter seventy-two. Yes. Okay. Go ahead. Can you read it out there? Read. Really? Go ahead. Tell us what it says. Go ahead. I got it in French and translated because I can't do all of that. Uh, let me. I thought you know. I thought you do not need to translation. You told me before. I do not need translation. I can understand the Quran. No, 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 no. I, I never said. No, that. you said that. You said I told you. Do you know Arabic? You said I do not need to know Arabic. Yes. Okay. So you are trusting now a translation in French. Yes. Okay. Is that a, is that an accurate translation? Uh. Okay, chapter 72, verse 8 to 10. Uh huh. See, people getting whooped. We will see, people are laughing already. You bait. You bait. Go ahead, you go know? ahead, go ahead. We are laughing. You see, I, 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 you know why I let you talk? Because we need, we need to, to laugh, honestly. Nobody is calling. So I said, okay. Go ahead. <laughs> Read it. What you just gave me is a comedy, you idiot. You are the one you now get your profit busted. So we were talking about the Big Bang and the Muslim, they claim that the Big Bang is in the Quran. And now we found that Allah, he guarded in the sky by the stars and he shoot as stars at the shaitan. And now you are telling me that the reason Allah, he do that, I say to you, where it says that they came down, the shaitan, many of them, not one, where it says that you said to me, go to chapter 72, verse number eight and nine, where it says that in what you said to me, go ahead. Huh? We read uh, verse 8, it says, uh -huh. the, jinn is the jinn is talking. You told me where the jinn is talking. Oh, where? no, I told you, first of all, I thought oh. this is Allah is talking, turn to be the jinn is talking. So in verse number 8, it says the jinn is talking? Yes, the jinn. Ah, okay, okay, and then what happened? Okay. In verse 8, uh -huh. they went up. They got hit by bullets. In verse 9. Okay, hold on, hold on, Abdul. Focus with me, focus. You are nervous. I'm asking you, I ask you, where in the Quran it says that genies, many of them, they came down and now they are trying to come back. You said, let us go to chapter 72, verse number 8. Here it doesn't say about them coming down. It okay. says, they try to reach the heaven, but they found it fill, or, uh, uh, filled with uh, guardians and the flame of fires, correct? Okay, so now you're accepting that the, a lot of genes are trying to go up. Now, let me show no, you. No, you want to show me where they are coming down. We, okay. we knew the Quran saying the genie they tried to get out, but here the, the, the funny is, my friend, that isn't it the Quran says that nobody can get out anyway? Same let time, me. same time, same time. I Now you want to show me where it says the shell team they came down from heaven go ahead okay if, if the verse we just read 1850 god said Wakana, what 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 what, cha what chapter 1850 okay 1850 hold on yeah you go to 18. i got answers brother <laughs> uh-huh let us see we want to laugh all right Go ahead. Read, okay, read it for us. 1850. Go ahead. 
Allah said when ah. he t when he asked the angel to fall prostrate for Adam, mm -hmm. they they all fall prostrate, but Iblis he was among the jinns in the plural. Uh -huh. He was among the jinns. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. in... Now, if you go to chapter, if you go to chapter two, verse thirty. No, no, no! Don't jump! Don't jump! How many jinn Allah he ordered to come down? Oh, he said, all of you go down. No, oh. no, you are, you, you are a liar. It says, yes. all of you, Adam and Eve and Iblis, Iblis, except Iblis. There's only one person. His name is Iblis. Disobey, correct? Go to the verse. He said, all of you go down. No, you are a liar. Read carefully. Who is the one? Who is the one? Okay, hold on. So you are saying to me, you're stupid. That when Allah, he order, yes. and he say, get down. He ordered yes. all the genie to get down, correct? And Adam, all huh? the genies, carnal genie. Now, if okay. is anybody, but who is the one who disobey Allah? Listen to me. Why did who he is the him? one? Who is the one who disobey Allah? Iblis. Iblis. First. So why Allah want to kick out the rest if they are not the one who disobey Allah? Listen to me. What you learning from that is that every time <laughs> one disobeyed, he got put among the genies. Every time one disobeyed, he got put among the jinns. What, 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 hold on, what, what? Everyone Anyone disobeyed who is going to be among you see, Iblis disobeyed, right? Yeah, and then he was among the jinn, so he got put among the jinns. What do you mean, he but he is he's a genie, you stupid. The jinn, the shaitan is a genie, he is not put in there. He will no, that, that, that's what I said. So, all of those did Allah say, all of you go, go down on that. He said that to Shaitan and Eve and Adam. All. You don't lie. Okay, hold on. If we open interpretations of Rashad Khalifa, they will say what you are saying. Allah said all of you. If we open Rashad Khalifa, the one you like, is he going to say that? An interpretation for. Why you are lying then? Why you are so if there is no single Muslim agree with your stupidity, that's mean I am telling the truth. If there is a single Muslim agree with your lie now, you're trying to cover yourself. You said that shaitan he come down and Allah he order all the genie to come down. When this is not a true, it's there is it says it says, hold on, it's stupid. Iblis is one of the jinn. Doesn't mean there is jinn. Ad he, he was Ab Abdul, Jesus. Abdul, Abdul, you are stupid by, by birth. Let me sh let me show. Hold on, hold on. Iblis, Allah is telling you the kind of the kind of Iblis. Iblis is a genie. It doesn't say there's many jinn. You are a donkey. That's number one. Number two. Hold on. Nowhere it says. Nowhere it says there are many jinn. There's only one Iblis. Only I one. Said. Only one. And the rest are his children. Is that correct? No. Listen to me. Okay, hold on. Okay, I will listen to you. Is the genies are the children of Iblis or not? I said, let me speak now. You, said you will speak. Will... Give me the answer first. Is the is the genies are the children of Iblis or yes or not? I got to prove to you that there was a lot of genies. You said it was one. No genie. problem. But uh, give me the answer first. Either you say yes or no. Is the that is the genies are the children of Iblis? Yes or not? I said. I gotta answer your first question. No then problem. Answer. This is the main question because we want to know if there is many jinn or not. So, if the genies are they the children of uh, the children of iblis, or those they are exist before iblis? Not those up there. The iblis will be having g uh, children's in uh, progeny in earth on earth, not upstairs. Ah, upstairs. he have a children in earth. Ah, okay. Uh huh. <laughs> So, so now, so now, the genies in the earth, all of them, they are the children of Iblis. Is that correct? I said, most of them, Iblis will be having children, yes. And other genies will be having children. Some are good, some are bad. Okay. No, hold on. No, those are bad anyway. They are trying to spy at Allah. Y yes. Those yes. Are so are they good or bad? Those are the bad ones. Exactly. Those are the children of Shaitan, correct? Uh, don't confuse shaitan. Shaitan is not a creature. Shaitan, shaitan is iblis. Shaitan is iblis. No, no, no. Iblis <laughs> is the level of shaitan. No. Shaitan is iblis is the first shaitan. You're a donkey. Iblis is the first shaitan. No. You don't understand. Can that. you prove to me that there was a shaitan before iblis? Yes. Mm, go ahead. Every time somebody disobeyed, he's taken by shaitan. Only Shaitan make you disobey God. All right. 
So there was already <laughs> disobeyed God and Iblis joined them. Iblis joined Iblis joined before they come down, Iblis joined the group. Show me show me the story in the Quran. It says there is a group of genie that is obey Allah in the in the in the heaven. Go ahead. In the same verse in 1850, Allah said when he refused, he joined the, the jinns. Where it says he joined. What kind of mineral jinn? He was among what? the jinn. What? No, he kind of mean he was of the among jinn. Jinn. He was one of the jinn, which means he's the kind of the jinn. Adam is a human. Jinn is the kind. So he is, he is differentiation between the human angels and jinn. So shaitan is a genie. This is what it says. And you are saying to me, he put among the jinn. Where it says that in the verse, you're lying. He was one of the jinn, which means he is a genie. This is his kind. What can I mean a jinn? This is the translation saying that to you. You, Luz, you just, you just <coughs> debunked your, your own self. Hmm. First, Go ahead. He was one jinn. Now he said he, he was one of the jinns. So then. No, then he is one of the jinn as kind, you idiot. Adam is one of the human. But there's only one human at that time, and there's only one Iblis at that time. If there's two Iblis. No, no, no. Listen, listen. Is there is to, is there is to Iblis? There is no one verse that says Adam or Wakanda. Okay, okay, hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on. When Allah, He said, get down from heaven, all yeah. of you. You said this is all the genies. Now you, now you tell it. So then Allah did No, say no, no, no. Hold on. I said to you, if there is one Muslim in the world, agree with what you said. You refuse no, to give me the answer. Bro, if I said Don't call me bro. Give me give me that give me the truth. If there is one Muslim in this earth, agree with what the stupid thing you said, or the only unique donkey is you who fabricate different meaning that there was many genies in heaven and Allah he kicked them out, all of them. Yes. If I say Okay, where we can't where we can't find the proof of what you are claiming. That Allah, He kicked all the genie. Allah, He says, except Iblis, you idiot. Except Iblis. Only Iblis disobey Him. Nowhere it says that there is genies disobey Allah. The first one ever who disobey Allah is Mr. Iblis. So can you show me your majesty where it says there was genies who they are disobeying Allah exist in heaven? Go ahead. Good. Now, mm. if I say... I ask all the human beings to fall prostrate. Mm. They all did accept Christian prince. Mm. He was among the prisoners. So now where it says the prisoner, where you got the word the prisoners? Something, a group of something. No, it no, no. This is the kind. This is the kind. You are being stupid. You see why I don't have patience for you. You are so stupid. You are so silly. You are just a kid, six years old. Even a, not a thing. So look, look what happened. You agreed, not a single Muslim agree with you. So you are fabricating religion, new religion. Same time, when Allah, he order only one person, one person who is, hold on. The verse actually shown us how stupid the Quran, because Allah, he commanded the angels to bow down. And then he said, except Iblis, he did not bow down. So yes. Allah, he is given a penalty for someone he been not ordered to bow down. For Iblis is from the jinn. That's why the Quran says, and he was from the jinn, because the verse says, we commanded the angels to bow down. So the stupid Quran maker, he make it clear that Allah command the cat to say meow, and then he get upset from the dog for not saying meow. But the dog is a dog. Allah did not command any except the angels, but there is, but, but there is one person, he is shaitan, and they call him Iblis, he is the one who refused to bow down, which means everybody bow down. Is that correct? I said, how do you translate Wakana min al jinn? He he was a genie. He was a genie. It's your turn, Muslim translation. But hold on, meaning what? Meaning his kind, his kind is a genie. He's not an angel. No, 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 no. Meaning that he was created a jinn. Is what he said? Yeah, he is created from fire because angels are created from light. Genie no, created no. from fire. Adam created from dirt. So the, the, your God is telling you that he is a from different kind. He is not an angel. He is not an angel. He is a genie. So the stupid you, you, you gave me an answer, which every, every Muslim will laugh at you. I challenge any Muslim. 
in your channel they say we agree with you and you can show them the reference where you get this from people will laugh there's only one person from there's only one person from those who you call them genie exist in his time this is why they asked the companion of muhammad how shaitan he have children one of the companion he answered and he said this is a wedding party i have not attended and then we go to a tabari we will find that shaitan he used to have a penis in the right leg and a vagina in the left leg because he's the only genie that exists when he came down to the earth and there's no other genie in heaven too it's only him and then he if himself he do nikah to himself by entering the penis he have in that right thigh into the left vagina and then he laid in eggs and from every eggs 72 shaitan and shaitana which mean male and female shaitan come out is it true this is what your, your, your book saying let me speak is it I true speak. is it true what i said or i'm making things up change again no stay on the subject listen. this is the subject there's only one shaitan Listen, I There's only Arab one shaitan sent down to the earth, and that shaitan he have sex with himself and he lay eggs. This is what I, Muslim books teach. Listen to me. I asked you, <clears throat> saying that Wakana Minal Jin means he was all. He was a genie. He, his kind is a genie. His kind. Angels are angels, so the Quran is telling you what his kind is, you idiot. It's in the front of you. Same time, hold on. You know what? Let us go with you just for the sake of fun. So now he is one of the jinns, and then Allah, he command all them to come down. Why the jinns are commanded to come down? You said to me, they are prisoners. Yes. But this is the first time, this is the first time anyone disobey Allah. Why they are prisoners? First time. That's not the first time. Where? Show me where. It, show me the first time. Then. Allah is letting you know. If you saying, or everybody. Show me the first time where the genie disobey Allah. Now let me speak. Now. I'm letting you speak. I, I want you to give me proofs, not speeches. I would no. I'm letting you understand. No, if I don't want to understand. I want evidence. Where the first time? When the first time the genie disobey Allah? gotta let me see whatever debunk me no whatever. you know I, i'm letting you speak i want an evidence you are making things up and now you are trying to explain the second i must let me explain that's mean he have no answer let me explain you have so are you saying to me you have no other proof in the quran saying there was many genies disobeying allah and you fabricated that by yourself but you, if, if you let me speak but you won't let me because you're a coward. I'm going to let you speak, you're a coward, and you are the one refused to give me the evidence. Can you, can you give me a verse? I will put it in the screen. It says, there was many genies before that time disobeying Allah, and they were prisoners for Allah. Go ahead. Okay. If Allah says, the, because he disobeyed, <coughs> said, وَكَانَ مِنَ الْجِنِّ فَفَسَقَ عَنْ أَمْرِ رَبِّي Among the jinn, because he disobeyed, the order of his Lord. Uh -huh. So what in Jin is for him having disobeyed the orders. So hmm. anybody disobeyed is now among the jinns. Ah, so, so Allah did not create the jinn from the beginning a jinn. He made them a jinn because they disobey him. Is that what you are saying? The verse saying it. That, that say, Okay. Okay. But look how stupid you are. Just show just to the people who laugh at you loudly. And now, because you promised me you will put it in your channel, let's see how, Muslim, how many Muslims will laugh at you. You are the one who said to me that there's bad jinn and there's good jinn. But now you are claiming that all the bad ones are jinn. No, 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 I didn't say that. No, you said that, you said that. Because he disobey Allah, everybody heard you. Because he disobey Allah, he put him among the prisoners, the jinn. So now, only the one who disobey Allah, he make them jinn. You said that already. But you strip at you is the one who said to me, there's a good jinn and bad jinn. So how you are a good jinn and you are a prisoner of Allah? Why it, man? <laughs> why 99% of the time? Now, let me explain to you now. Uh. Anybody disobeyed, Adam disobeyed, Iblis disobeyed. Hmm. Adam was asked not to approach the tree. Iblis was asked to fall prostrate for, for, for Adam. Mm -hmm. When Iblis was asked, hey, why did you not fall prostrate when I asked you to? He said, because I am better than him. That's arrogance. Now you become Satan. No, no, no. What, 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 what? He did not, he did not, he did not just say I'm better than him. He said what? Hold on. When Iblis was asked, yeah. why did you not fall prostrate for Adam? Uh -huh. 
he said because I'm I'm better than him. خلقتني من من نار و آها خلقتني من نار so he is created from what from fire exactly this is his kind genie so you see how stupid you are so the reason he did not hold on so the reason he did not the reason he did not but down hold on you see you got yourself busted to me with the verse on the screen so yes. he was a created from fire from the beginning but you said when he disobey he made him a genie how is a genie made listen you said when he disobey he made him a genie when you disobey he made you a genie. everybody heard you it's recorded i said how is a genie made from fire according to the quran no no from what yes. Iblis talking as an angel. If you go to chapter 55 of 28, Exactly. So here it says that Jinn from the beginning created her from a smoke to a flame of fire, you idiot. So you, you quote for me a verse, you quote for me a verse proving that what I said is true. So from the first creation, how the, how the genie is created, he was created as a genie, he was not an angel, and he became a genie. <laughs> Are you saying that Minnar is the same as Min Marijin Minnar? Your stupid is the same. Are you serious? Okay, hold on. I want I want you I want you to name the video of your title saying that all angels use Shaitan, he used to be an angel. He was made from light and then Allah made him into fire. Do you agree? Or the Christian prince said, the Arabic guy said that Min Marijin Minnar is okay. the same as Are you serious? But this is what you must then believe, not me. I'm, I'm talking. No. Okay, can we open any interpretation to see what it's mean? Because now we disagree what it's meaning, right? So, are you saying, hold on, uh, listen, listen, you're a potato, everybody will for you. Let, uh, uh, no, 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 hold on. Can you name for me one Muslim scholar from the big ones agree with you against me? CP. Can you name for me one Muslim scholar agree with you against me, or all Muslim scholars agree with me that genie was a created from the beginning a genie and he never was an angel? Uh, I said uh, no. You, you. I'm. I, I'm, not, I, I'm saying the opposite. Well, what are you talking? No, about? you said that genie when he disobey Allah the Shaitan. He made him a genie. He was not a genie. He made him a fire because now he disobeyed Allah. Uh, no, he, uh, uh, he was made fire. What? He was made fire. Listen okay, so now he is not an angel, correct? He was it. That's how angels are made of fire. The angels are made from fire. Abdul. <laughs> Let me speak. Abdul, Abdul. Okay, now I, I want you to tell me, and again, uh, let us repeat. You see this guy, he can play. This is why I, don't, I hang up on him. So I want you to tell me if there is one Muslim in the world agree that angels are made of fire, not only the genie. Is there one Muslim in the world that uh, that believe that, uh, that that Jesus was crucified? Oh, don't change the topic, potato. I'm just letting you know. I don't give a Don't, no, in, uh, listen. Don't change the topic because if if not a single Muslim agree with you, that means you are fabricating your own religion. Read the verse. You said min margin, min Hold on, min let me get you busted and everybody will laugh at you. You're a prophet, he said, that angels are created from light. Oh, I am giving you a verse. I'm, I'm giving you, you I'm giving you your prophet interpretation and your prophet explanation. So how you how you say that this is not valid? So why you're a prophet? Why your prophet was such a thing? CP, listen to me. Can I speak for two minutes? You are listen speaking. Hold on. I asked you for a proof that Shaitan Shaitan was not made of fire. Five seconds here. I'm having ten seconds here. Five seconds here. <laughs> Let me elaborate and explain. You you are speaking more than me, but you are avoiding to answer the question. So I'm asking you. If there is one reference, one Muslim in the world, you agree now that all the Muslims in the world agree with the Christian prince against a guy from Ghana who do not know how to read his Quran except in the French. Listen, Abdul. Okay. So, it, it, is it true that Muhammad he said that angels are created from light 
and genie created it from fire. Now, genies are created from fire with smoke. Waljana halakbahu min marijin minnar. Aha. Min ma. Ah, minnar. Supposedly now he know Arabic, you know, but you know Arabic. I mean, why well, you get excited like you're Mimi Hijab? So this is one of the change the thing. Is the angel created from light? Yes or no? Why are you saying that that Allah said He created the jinn min marijin minnar? Why why are you taking the min marijin off? I'm not why? taking it. I'm not taking it. You stupid Abdul. What's wrong with you? He created it from nar, from fire. Marijin from nar is a fire still. Iblis is saying, I've been. Praying. Okay, hold on, hold on, Abdul. If we open that interpret the translation of Rashad Khalifa, do you accept it? I accept. I, I told you five different translations. Okay. He's among what is what is Rashad Khalifa translation? Can you read it for me for this verse? Go, go, go get it. I'm outside in the parking lot walking around. Okay. Bye. Okay. Let us Google it now uh, until I find it. I, w I want you to tell me what marriage from nor mean. Okay. Uh -huh. If you want to mean, if you know what, what mean marriage mean, you go to for marriage. Allah talked about the marriage. Marriage means in between. Allah talked about the, the marriage al Bahrain. In between the two seas. You stupid idiot. Marriage have nothing to do with marriage, you donkey. You the are same. you are a certified donkey. You do not know Arabic. And now you are saying to me, you speak Arabic. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. In your translation, in your translation, did you can you read the translation for me again in English? The trans can you translate the verse for me again? You said no, no, you no, 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 no. Give give me the translation you just gave me, yourself. Go ahead. Said, did you say that? Give me the translation. Give me the translation. You just read for us. Go ahead. So that you repeat that, and I, I make a you video you give me the translation you wish you want. Give me the translation. No. You did not pick no, you, you gave me the translation because everybody will laugh at you. Your own translation. Give it to me in English. A Quranic definition of marriage. Okay. That's it. What marriage, I you said. donkey? Here we go. This is Rashad Khalifa, and you said you agree with him. It says he created the genie from blazing fire. This is what marriage from fire mean. You are a donkey. Admit. Okay, you me. said you accept Rashid Khalifa to be your prophet who, who accepted the Quran to be corrupt and you agree with him that the Quran have a lot of corruption and he took it away. All the corruption. Wonderful. So now we prove the Quran to be corrupt. You said you accept the translation of Rashid Khalifa and you said to me that marriage have nothing to do with being fire. You said marriage mean from between fire. This is Rashad Khalifa saying Created the, the jinn from blazing fire. Between the fire and the smoke. Where is the word between, donkey? Why you are adding words? There's a huge difference, Abdul. There's a huge difference between I created the guy from between the fire or I created him from fire. So why Rashad Khalifa lying saying created the jinns from blazing fire and you are the one who said you accept him? Marriage. No, I'm asking you now as an Arabic speaker. Don't change the topic. Marriage. Suddenly I am an Arabic speaker now. Look at this donkey. A second ago, he want to school me about Arabic. And then he said to me, he accept Rashad Khalifa. We go to Rashad Khalifa. We got him busted. We left our five fingers on him. And now every Muslim will laugh at you. I want to I want to ask the Muslims a favor. How many of you would laugh at this man saying that the genie and the angels are the same, created from the same object and genie were, were angels? How many of you believe that the genies were exist in heaven and they were prisoners because they disobey Allah? How many of you agree with this donkey with Rashad Khalifa translation, which now he don't want to agree with it? I agree with it. Now, how about but, you go But down? he did not say, but he did not say anything except blazing fire. I created him from blazing fire. There's no between. Same time, Abdul, stupid. Even if you say the word between, that is not to change anything. The Quran explained to us how he created the genie. Obviously, they are not the same as the angels. That's why he called them genie. Now go now. Now I want you to go where where Iblis said you made me a fire of of nar and see if Rasha said blazing fire. You go stupid. You stupid. We no, we, no. we have that already in the screen. Oh, no, 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 okay, no, no, same no, time, no. same time. I just don't, don't, you see? Uh, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go down with the video and post it. We have already put on your channel. Go, son of Muta. 
I mean, coward, liar, shameless, no honesty. We are bored, yes, but we have enough. Let every Muslim laugh at you, you donkey. There's the prisoners of war of genie in the heaven of Allah. And Allah told all the genies to come down with Adam and Eve. And then we ask him if there's a single scholar agree with you. That yet nobody agree with him. They agree with me. What a coincidence. All Muslim cleric in the world, they did not understand the Quran except him. However, what we prove today that the Quran is a fairy tale stories. The Quran is speaking about genies going up to heaven to spy at Allah. How they can do that? I mean, who is the stupid donkey here? If Allah he says get down, that mean get down mean nothing. They can still go up. And then Allah, in order to protect his heaven, he have to shoot their ass. He have to put a sniper machine. And he used the stars to shoot a genie. But isn't it the genie sleeping in your nose? But isn't it the genie made of fire? How you can destroy fire by fire? Are you going to kill a person he is made from fire by burning him? Who is the stupid here? <laughs> you know, he is the kind when the second he is like, you know, we put him in trouble. So he tried to fabricate stories now. There was a prisoners of war and those genie that disobey Allah. Okay, where we can find that? Well, nowhere. It's, it says only except Iblis, only Iblis. And then he says it was, it was one of the jinn. Like, well, he was, what, what one of the jinn mean? Let us read Kashat Khalifa interpretation. We would die laughing. Do you accept Rashad Khalifa? You accept Rashad Khalifa. We go to Rashad Khalifa, we see that he is lying. Do you know what marriage means? What marriage means? Between? Between fire, not from fire. <laughs> from between fire. <laughs> and you know, in, in this, by the way, in those verses, we find him very funny, very stupid, because Allah, he ordered the angels to bow down, yet he is angry from someone he is not an angel and now this donkey he's trying to fix it because this is a mistake you cannot explain to me why you want to punish someone he was not commanded we say to the angels bow down to adam who the angels Iblis is the exception, he did not bow down, but he is not from the angels. So this is stupid in the Quran. Mistake. The Quran, Muhammad, he covered his ass by saying, and he was one of the jinn, which means this is his kind. In the other verses, this potato, he mentioned to us, explained to us that jinn is different kind. And how we can prove actually that from the beginning, both they were jinn, and angels, the Quran says in different verse, everything he created, he created only to worship, and those who they are on earth specifically. But for sure, the angels too. And when he said, This is how stupid he is. He mentioned that there is good jinn and bad jinn. But then he claimed that those jinns are, the, the reason they call them jinn because they are prisoners. But how they are bad jinn and good jinn and they are prisoners? In which, which religion in Islam, which books, it says that genies disobey Allah in heaven? Where we can find that? All those verses in front of us is speaking about the jinn and the human. And it confirmed that not all the jinn, they will go to hell, many of them. So there is good, 
genie and there is a bad genie. There is a Muslim genie, there is a Christian genie, there is a Hindu genie, there is an atheist genie. There is all kind of genie which we cannot see. Chapter 7 verse 179 and surely we have created many of the jinn of man and mankind for hell. Many of them, not all of them. They have heart wherewith they understand not. They have eyes, blah, 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 blah. And here you see the stupidity. Jinn, they have hearts. They are supposedly are invisible creatures. They have heart. They have eyes. Not only that, actually, they believe they have penises, and yet they are made from fire. And then he continues saying, in different place. Let us see uh, all those verses, like chapter 15, verse number 26, speaking how Allah created the human being. Speaking of Allah created the genie. You will notice that the Quran make it clear that genies are not angels and angels are not genie and a human is not an angel. We have tons of verses in the front of us. All of them, they mention to us how everything is created, which is very funny and we laugh at them. But we cannot find one Muslim agree with this stupid man. One, just one. You see, if all the Muslims, or let us say a million Muslim, agree with him, I would say, okay, maybe, you know what? There's a group of them, they have this understanding. But not a single person. So now this guy, because he's in the corner, he created a new religion, a new understanding for the Quran that there was genies in the heaven disobeying Allah and Allah he put them in jail and when Iblis he disobey Allah Allah he made him join the jail which is full of genies and then Allah he commanded Adam and Eve and all the genies who they are in jail to go down but that mean all the genie who came down they are bad but the Quran says, we just showed you the verses, there's good genie and there's bad genies. Very stupid, very arrogant, very funny, and very shameful person. At least this time he did not say the F word. You know? Allah created the jinn and the human except to worship him alone. If Allah created the jinn and the human, and that means jinn are angels, well, that will change the whole idea of Islam because the Muslim they say that Jibreel is the Holy Spirit, but genie are not a spirit. They are made from fire. And I showed the hadith of his prophet, and for sure he will deny it, because he is a fraud like the rest of them. Who understand better who is who and who is not? Muhammad supposedly. Muhammad, he said, and this is authentic hadith, the angels were created from light and the jinn were created from a smoke, smokeless a flame of fire. And Adam was created from which, you know, sounding clay. How clear we can make it more than this. So they argue by line. We have all the evidence in our hand against them from their books. And yet they defend. However, isn't it really horrible, stupid of you to tell me that Allah, he shoots stars to stop genie from stealing information? And you are the one who speak French and English? If Allah he command the genie to come down, that means genies should not be able to go up anymore. Who needs the sky have guards? Isn't you Muslim you say if Allah wants something to happen, he say B is going to be? 
So just to prove to me that the bee of Allah is a bee making honey, is a fly in the garbage, it doesn't mean anything. Because Allah, he said to the jinn, is good down, yet they are trying to get up. And how to stop them? By shooting them. So Allah is not the Almighty. If Allah is God and he said, Christian Prince, you will never be able to enter my heaven. And Christian Prince, he tried to enter heaven. And then what Allah, he do to stop me, he have a sniper, he shoot at me. That mean I can. If not the sniper, his word get down mean nothing. And I apologize for having this person even though I made a promise I will not have him. But, you know, he is like, you know, is in, 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 my, in, in, my, in my socks nonstop. He keep calling, texting. So just to show you and let all the Muslims in the world die laughing at his lies. Not a single Muslim agree with this donkey. If I go right now and search in Google, he said to me, search in Google. Let us see. Let us see. <clears throat> Our search is genies are the same as angels. And I will not take any website unless it's official Islamic scholars website. You will see the answer. It says no. I opened the first one come in my way islamweb.net it's taking time to open let us see what the difference between angels and jinns right away before we I don't know it's not opening right away it says the difference between the angel and the jinn the fatwa number blah 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 the angels are created from light while genie are created from fire It's in front of you. You can go do research right now. All Islamic websites, not a single one. This is why when we ask, if there is one Muslim in the world, agree with you. Hear what he said to me? If there is one Muslim in the world, agree that Jesus is crucified? Yeah, there is. Sheikh Omran. <laughs> Sheikh Omran, he agreed that Jesus was a crucified. And what does this have to do with my topic? Because religion is what people believe, not one individual. If there is a person he claim he call himself a Christian, but he don't believe in the crucifixion, he don't believe in the Trinity, he is no Christian. He can call himself whatever he want. He can be a new religion. He can start a new religion, have a new followers, no problem. But he is he cannot be called Muslim. He cannot be called Christian. He cannot call, be called Hindu unless he agree with the Hindu, unless he agree with the Muslims. In order to stop the humility they get, they have to lie to cover their lies. And the more they lies, the more deep it is. Let me explain to you. You are not letting me talk. Are you going to run away? Download the video, put it in your channel. Let us see and let the comment be open, donkey. I challenge you. Let the comment open. Muhammad and always what they do, they turn off the comment for the comment which is going to come to them from Muslims will be a very embarrassing comment. What they did not know was that Allah made it appear to them that he was crucified. <clears throat> What's the definition of crucifixion? It is that you should die by hanging on the cross. What is the definition of death? 
answer? The definition of death. Is that Allah should send the angel to take the soul and not return it. Is there anyone who differs with me? The definition of death is that Allah should take the soul and not return it. Can Allah take the soul and return it? Tell the schoolboy, go back and study the Quran. <laughs> so then what did Allah do to make it appear that he died? Let me warn you. Mm -hmm. And my language is sometimes very harsh because that's the only language some people can understand. This is the only language, I agree. Don't come with this nonsense. Islam is nonsense. Because it is not only pathetic nonsense, it is absolutely sinful. I totally agree. Shaitan, he want to spy at Allah. Allah, he showed him by a star, and this is the reason we have stars. Shaitan, he sleep in your nose, but yet Allah, he need a star to show him, not a bullet. I mean, have you ever heard of a stupid religion like this? And this donkey, he called me to defend. And he asked one of his kids, friends, to call me and speak so he can't take the microphone. Here we go, we give you the microphone. Who is a Mohammedan agree with this donkey about what he said? Give me a call. Even his friends. Do you remember once he asked his friend to call me? You remember the guy? Cuckoo fort was next to him and then when I asked him about do you agree with with fort he said no I don't agree even the one he sent him to talk to me he don't agree with him so who agree with you they cannot understand the Quran they cannot explain the hadith they don't accept each other interpretation they don't accept their scholars. Suddenly everyone became a scholar, even the one who do not know how to read the Quran. Yet he read the Quran in French, but yet he can explain to us what marriage mean. But he just told me he is going to read it in French because he don't understand. Suddenly he wanna school me in Arabic in a language he do not know. Do you know what marriage mean? Okay, what marriage? You remind me of Muhammad Dawa, Muhammad uh, Mimi Hijab. He said, Elijah means God with us. <laughs> I mean, they knew all languages. They speak all languages, brother. I mean, what you can do? You cannot debate a Muhammadan. Just to show you how stupid you are. This is the dictionary. Open the dictionary. Dictionary mean marriage mean between. The Quran says marja marja. You stupid idiot. That is different word. Donkey marriage. There is alif. Marriage is different. Marriage ism. It's a noun. Here al marriage ushola satiya that ulhabi shadid, which is a, fl a flame mixed with a, a, a dark. A fire. Let us use the translation, Google translation, just to show you. Open the dictionary. We will open the dictionary. Marriage is a bright flame. Very bright flame. Or a flame mixed with the blackness of fire. Do you see why we laugh at them? A potato from Ghana, he wanna teach me Arabic. And marriage mean between. As long marriage being between, 
Well, the translation you are reading should say the word between. This is why he refused to read the translation again. <laughs> I said to him, can you read the translation again? <laughs> he refused. <laughs> well, I mean, can we find one, one Quran translating the word marriage as between? Even his stupid translation of Rashad Khalifa translated as a blazing fire. There's no between. How embarrassing. And this guy, you know, this guy is like a guy who go to the casino. He gambled with all his money. He come back only he have his underwear. So he lost his honor. He lost his property. He lost her virginity. And he want to take it back. So he keep calling me. And each time he call me, the same story happened. He end the same way. But I find it very amazing how far this guy he use or he go in his fantasy answers just to cover the stupidity he made. I believe it strongly, by the way, he did not go, he did not want to go and say what he said. But then, because now he's in the corner, and I said to him, okay, show me that there was many genies in the heaven, and Allah asked him to come down. He thought to himself, he would say it, and then he would go to the second verse. He said, let me go to the second verse, he will not let me talk. I said, no, before you go. And this is the difference between me and other Christians. I will hold you from your feet on the place until you finish the verse. Don't quote for me two words and jump. This is what he was trying to do. He caught a verse from there, he caught a verse from there, and now he tried to confuse people one by one. And right away he is in the trap. Who is a Mohammedan would like to call us? Allah, he protect his heaven by a flaming fire. And that is the stars. And why he do that? Because genie, he tried to spy at Allah. I thought Allah is behind the seven gates of heaven. How they can spy? You know, when Muhammad, he went to the heaven, aka hell, He found gate, even the angel could not get in. There's a gate. And the angel Jibreel, he said to them, open the gate. Why we need fire if we have walls and gates? As you see, the angel himself, he cannot get in. <laughs> Do you see why we laugh at Muhammad? If there, if the angel himself cannot get into the heaven, there are seven gates, and the distance between one of them. And by the way, this guy himself, he said to me, the distance between them is five hundred years. He said to me, there's a hundred level of heaven, hundred level, and Allah in the top. So, Muhammad is going up to heaven. And he have the company of the angel Jibreel with him. The angel Jibreel himself, he could not get in. I'm just trying to find you the hadith. Let me turn off the screen so I will not blind you by flipping. When the angel Jibreel arrived to the first gate, he asked him to open the gate. They asked him, who is with you? There's a fence, there's a gate. How come they did not start shooting before they arrive? Because as you see, they don't even know who is behind the gate. 
What difference is going to be making if it is Jibreel or, or, or a genie or shaitan? Here we go. They cannot know who is behind the gate. Read carefully with me. And then he went forth. Muhammad now, he ride a donkey, flying donkey. He have two wings in his thigh, which is very fi funny uh, kind of uh, airplanes where the wings in the thigh of the donkey. Then the don he's a donkey smaller than a mule and the stride was long as the eye could reach. Look how man was mounted in it. And then we went forth till we reached the lowest heaven. This is exactly where the fight should happen. In the lowest heaven where the stars are located, where the genie should be stopped. But look what we have in the lowest heaven. We don't have any fire to guard it. The angels behind the gate do not know who is behind the other side of the gate. Jibreel, if he did not talk, nobody even will bother. Jibreel asked for the gate to be open. It was said, who is he? They are asking Jibreel, who is he? The angels do not even know the voice of their boss. According to Islam, Jibreel is the highest angel. And now the, the guy, Jibreel, he keep coming up and down every day. Yet, the angels who they are guarding the gate, they do not know the voice of Jibreel. So they asked Jibreel, who are you? He just said, open the gate. Imagine if a Christian prince, he go, I mean, if there is one of you, he will not know my voice. Be honest, I'm not Jibreel. If I go to any country in the world, you never saw me. If I open my mouth and I speak to you right away, you will know I'm a Christian prince. This is Jibreel. And this guy, he keep going up and down, 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 get a message, up and down. Non stop, let us get, you know. Okay, don't change topic now. You know, you know, if you are in India, you will make a movie about it. In India, you know, you will feel a drama a movie, and suddenly there's 10,000 people behind the two guys, the girl and the boy, they are dancing. Where they came from, don't ask. It's like, like the Quran. So Gabriel asked the gate to be open. There's no fire. Nobody's shooting. Nobody said, stop where you are or we will shoot you. Who is there? And this is how we can expose all the lies about this. There's no fire. It's just a fence and a gate and open the gate. And who is with you? And who are you? They don't even have like, you know, in the, like in the old days, they have like a, a balcony, windows. They can see who is out. They don't. They have a very basic fence. They cannot see who is behind the door. Who are you? Gabriel asked the gate for the gate to be open and it was said, who is he? They are asking Gabriel, who is he? Can you believe it? And not only that, that means when Allah, he come down, he have to th go through those gates. <laughs> Is that correct? Allah himself, when he come down, like Lili Dawah, he do not know how Allah, he come down. We know how he come down. He go through the gate. I have no idea how it happened. You have no idea anything. <laughs> but this is the same donkey, he said. Anything that is in the creation cannot be God. Anything that is in the creation cannot be God. We believe Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala enters into his creation. How that happens? How, how it happens? I have no idea how it happened. You have no idea anything. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Lili Dawa refuting Lili Dawa. <laughs> Donkeys. Then microphone in his t-shirt. This guy really, he think like he is something. And the same, this guy, he asked his friends, 
He was digging for his, his grave. You just dig very grave. You know, call him, call him. I want to show you how a Christian prince he ran away from me. There's a genie prisoners, and genie made the same as the angel. And later, Allah, he made him fire. Uh, true story. If there is somebody agree with you? Who cares if they don't agree with me? <laughs> Do we have any Muhammadan like Lili Dawa or Fakira? They are super smart, so we can laugh. Open the gate. And they are asking him, who is, who are you? Go and buy the software of the Israeli. They have face recognition. I mean, the angel Jibreel, supposedly, he is so big, he can cover the horizon. Yet the angels behind the gate, and he is their boss. They are asking him, who are you? Do we have any Muhammadan? May they, may they. Your prophet says Allah created the angels from light and the genie from fire from the beginning. There's no... Shaitan, he was one of the angels. In Christianity, angel, Satan, is a fallen angel, not in Islam. And Allah, he kicked only three out of the heaven of Islam. And all Muslims agree. May they, may they, any Muhammadan. Any Muslim? Not even one Muslim? The only donkey he called me is this donkey? That's not right. Hmm. Any Abdul? And you know one thing actually he mentioned it's, it's very very nice. He said I ask him. Uh, about the chapter of the genie. I said, who is talking? He said, the genie. He said that, right? Okay. How the Muslim, they say nobody can make Quran if all of this is the genie making Quran. This is what the genie said. The genie, the genie are talking. So Allah is quoting the genie and yet Allah, he say, who can make Quran like the genie Quran? Do you understand what I'm saying? When I said to him, I thought Allah is the one is talking. He said, no, the genie. And he's right. The one is talking is the genie. But that means when the stupid Allah, he says, who can make Quran like the Quran? Allah himself is copying Quran from the genie. If the Quran is a quotation of somebody saying something, how that can be a miracle from God? Are you with me? Not only Allah is copying the genie, he is copying even the ants, even the birds, even Suleiman. If we go in the Quran, we will find this. The ant, she said, I thought the Quran Allah said, no, it's the ant. Allah is quoting Mrs. Ant. 
And then they strip the Quran and the Muhammad and they say to you, who can make Quran like this? Either the one who made the Quran is an, the author is Allah, then we can say every single word there is made by Allah. Or this Quran is just a bunch of fairy tale stories. It's a quotation. Tell when they come to the valley of the ants. No, this is the sentence Allah is talking. Anyone can make that. Anyone he can say until when they arrive to the valley of the ants. One of the ants said, and here start the ant talking. <laughs> this is the Quran of the ant. This is, you know, the Quran is like a football game and there's the guy behind the microphone for the TV. Go, 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 stop now, now. And now he's saying, let, let, let us, let us see what he's, uh, okay, the ant, she's saying, oh, ants, enter your dwelling, last Suleiman, and his horse to crush you, while he perceive not. And then you put it in the screen, in the football stadium. And then you claim that you are the one who come with this. And you claim and you challenge who can make Quran like the ant Quran, like the genie Quran, like Shaitan Quran, even the Quran, even Shaitan, he made Quran in the Quran. Allah is a commentator. He's a fairy tale. Look at this. Then Suleiman, he smiled. This is God talking. God, he care. This God is so cute. Once upon the time, upon the time, upon the time, once upon the time, there was an end. Once upon the time, once upon the time, she saw Suleiman flying in the sky. She said to her friends, hide, 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 before he crush you. Hide, 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 before he destroy you. Suleiman, he listened to her, he heard her, he smiled, ha ha ha, ha ha ha. What a cartoon. This is God? This is God, the one who created this massive universe, is sitting in the ground telling us a story that does not make sense even for five years old kids. Suleiman, he smiled, amused by her speech. You idiot, ants are deaf and they are mute. What speech? The ant, she was making a speech? Do you mean lit literature? Like she was saying to be crushed or not to be. That was the question. And the funny is, that Solomon, he was flying in the flying carpet with his kingdom, which all his soldiers in the top, and is he camels, horses, kitchen, wives, he carry everybody. And then Suleiman, he stopped the flying carpet. Zzz, stop, stop, stop. The driver stopped. He put the brake because he heard the ant saying that. And Suleiman, he said to himself, hmm. <laughs> Even the ants, they fear me. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. They fear I will crush them. I am the only one in the world who can crush ants by his feet. My size is so big. My shoes is humongous. I'm Solomon, the ant crusher. And then Suleiman, he ordered his soldiers to command the ant to come. The ant, she come to the king. Please, uh, you know, please forgive me, you know. And he said to her, oh, why you said I will crush the ants? Are you saying I am unjust and I will kill you unjustly? The ant, she was smart. And she said, no, honey, you got me wrong. I swear by Allah. Hey, why your voice become like Ayadawa? I swear by Allah. This is not what I meant. I was saying 
crush you by crushing your heart. When they see your beauty, Oop. it turned to be that the end will be crushed. They will have a crush. She doesn't mean a crushing. This is what the, this potato he is saying, by the way. He changed the word, crush you, to they, they will have a crush. If you read the story from the Muslim website and their books, you would die laughing. Actually, let me find it for you, as long as we don't have any customers. I'm typing in Arabic. <laughs> but sometime Google could, you know, like give me the answer, <laughs> like uh, use my Arabic to like make it right away English. The account, then account of Suleyma. Let us go to the end. What the heck? True story. Brothers and sisters. Ali ibn Ibrahim have narrated that when the wind raised the throne of Ibrahim, what Ibrahim? This is Solomon, the donkey he forgot. And reached the field of the ants, where silver and gold come out. That's where the... Hmm. All my life I wanted to know. I, I was thinking maybe I, you know, in Arizona we dig here, like, you know, we can find some uh, gold and silver, you know. Where the silver and gold come out? An Imam Sadiq said, there's on there's, there's there is one valley of Allah where silver silver and gold grown. <laughs> Only in Islam you can grow gold and silver in the valley of the ant. They grow by themselves like mushroom. No, lucky ants, you know. We cannot go there. They cannot go. The ant will eat you. Hello. <laughs> okay, and he protected it. Who oh, Allah? With the weakest creatures, I'm telling you, the ant is guarding the valley of the ants, which is full of gold and silver, where there's gold and silver grow. Like ants and powerful army won't enter it. It cannot do so. Now, if I if I come to you with the story like this and I say Islam teach this, you will laugh at me, don't you? This is their this is their books. This is their websites. This is their religion. Suddenly Islam is about the Big Bang and science, and this is the Quran and talking, so they man flying, flying carpet. And then <clears throat> now I'm sure many of you will start buying a ticket or searching in Google where's the value of the ant. <laughs> you want to go on an expedition, don't you? Oh, greedy people, you want to get the gold where the gold grow? <laughs> and look, even they give you the names. Listen, listen. Ibn Babawaya, according to the reliable, what is killing me in Islamic books, it's a reliable chain. Listen, it's not just a, you know, it's, it's reliable. This is a real, reliable story. I'm telling you. Why people don't want to believe in the reliable story? The narrators and the narration from the Imam as Sadiq that when the ant conversed with the others, the wind took their conversation to Suleiman. I'm telling you, the wind, the wind. Remember the Quran says, the wind and the document of Suleiman. So one of the jobs of the wind is to spy at what you say. They carry your conversation to Suleiman, the wind. At the time when he was on air, 
I told you he was a flying, but yet <laughs> you cannot you cannot skip Suleiman. He will hear anything. Imagine this guy. Anything, anyone, make a noise, even as far the wind will carry the sound to Suleiman. And then Suleiman ask the strong wind to stop. Stop! <laughs> and called out the ant. Ant, where are you? Imagine that moment, people. You are an ant who mentioned the name of Solomon. You thought nobody would hear you. You thought nobody would know. You thought Solomon is not even going to know. And then suddenly you hear a sound saying, And who spoke my name? Come here. So he called out the ant. It came to Suleiman. I mean, what you can do? She's an ant. Where she's going to run? Hide? <laughs> Good luck. A second ago, he says, no army can go there. A second after, the ant now in trouble. He said, don't you know that I am a prophet of Allah? And I do not oppress anybody. Yeah, the prophet of Allah don't oppress. They just take your wife, your children, your money. They rape you. They rape your wife and they torture you. They cut your fingers to tell them where you hide the money. Like what Muhammad did with the Jew. They beat you. They At the end of the day, they will kill you after they find the money. They don't oppress anybody. Absolutely. The aunt said, yes, 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 I know. Sorry, man. I know. Hello. Yeah, I know that. And then sorry, man, he said, huh? <laughs> then why did you scare others from me and order them to enter their holes? Look at Suleiman. This is a Trump investigation. Trump, he put the wrong item in the wrong file. It's a felony. Why, Trump, why? The Democrat, the rats. What? Huh? Investigation right away. Why you told them to enter the hole? Huh? The ant said, "Okay, hold on, hold on. I was scared. This is this is now ultimate part. Trying to find an escape. So she fabricated the story. It says in the in the in the Quran clearly, they will he will crush you. Now she want to find different reason. Uh, <clears throat> said." I was scared that when their vision falls on you, they will become fascinated with the beauty of the world and they will be away from Allah. What the heck? You are an ant. And now you see Suleiman. What you expect to happen? You will see the beauty of the world. You will see how sexy Suleiman is. So this aunt, she was lying. She is not afraid that he will crush them. She was afraid they would have a crush on him. You know, when somebody made a cartoon for Zach and Nick and he put the song, I'm sexy and you know it? That's so deep. Do we have any Muslim here? Do you see why they are ashamed to call? And the one and the only one who call us is the idiot who fabricate everything he say. The ant asked Suleiman, who is more honorable than you and or your father Dawood? Hold on. Are you saying to me the ant she said that he is more honorable than the Arab Muhammad? What? What the heck? That's not right. Now they will hear this, they will take it from the story. 
Who is more honorable than you and your dad? I thought Muhammad is more honorable. Maybe this aunt, she is not familiar with Muhammad yet. She don't have Facebook, Twitter, TikTok. Suleiman said, my father is much more esteemed and honorable than me. Oh boy, he made, she made him angry. The aunt said, then why? Look, she is, what the heck? She is debating Suleiman. The aunt, look at, look at this hot debate. Suleiman, he says, my father is much honorable than me. Suleiman, and she said to him, huh, what? Then why? Why is it so that your name has more, that has one more alphabet than your father's name? I could not, I, you know, I, I will never think about, I cannot win a debate like this. His name have more letter than his father name and that make him more honorable <sighs> me let us be honest brothers and sisters have you ever see such a debate like this how you can win a debate with an ant Thank God I did not meet an ant in my life. She speak. Otherwise, I will be crushed in the debate and I will lose my career. From now on, I'm going to add all the letters I can to my name. Because I want to be very honorable. The more letters, the more honor you have. Let us make it clear. Every honorable person have. Okay, now, who of you have a longer name than my name? None of you. Get lost, all of you. You are a loser. I'm the most honorable. Look at this. One name, one name. You know, okay, now, you know, I'm, I'm, you know I am out of alphabet. Hold on, I need to add more alphabet. Okay, that's, uh, you know, okay. So, guys, it's keep going, you know, keep going. So, now I become the most. <laughs> that was that is funny. One of you, he said, "Oh, hold on, let me let me show you what, what." Uh, man, typing all those letters, a screen, a freeze, it froze my screen. I can't even control my screen anymore. The letters keep going. Honestly, I am out of control. I'm not even typing. <laughs> Guys, I'm not typing. It's a miracle. Honest to God, my hand is not touching the screen. <laughs> it's not touching the keyboard. It keeps writing more and more. I need I, I don't, let me see if I can force it to stop. What the heck is that? How we can stop this now? Oh boy. My mouse is not functioning. What we did. Oh boy. I'm afraid we will lose our, our broadcast. Oh, now, okay, finally, look, the, 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 the program uh, crush, you know? <laughs> Sorry, I had to mute the microphone because I was unbelievable. What an honorable name you have, buddy. Have you ever heard and the Big Bang and science? And this is their books. The end, she got prophet Solomon busted. Well, you know what? Okay, hold on. So you are saying that your father is more honorable than you. Uh-huh. So now how you can explain to me, you idiot, that you have, your name have one more alphabet? Sorry, man, he said, huh, I don't know. What the heck? He give up. He don't even know. Sorry, man, he agreed with the logic of Mrs. Ant 
look like she is the wisest in the you know the whole family you know like you know like not like Tony and you know hey Tony get us some pizza hey, I'm an aunt I cannot talk now so and aunt said because your father did Tark al awla al awla. What the heck is that mean? I don't know what it's meaning uh, by the way, because I need to find the Arabic what they are saying. Tark al awla. Turq al awla maybe. Turq al awla. Like he is the more, like uh, I don't know maybe the like the old fashioned way. And due to that, had an injury in his heart, and we cured it. What the heck? It turned to be that this aunt, she have a hospital. <laughs> we cured it with the love of Allah. Due to this, he was called Dawood. This aunt, she knew science. She knew dictionary. She knew the meaning of Arabic word, Hebrew word. She is like Mimi Hijab, Elijah mean God with us. We grew it with the love of Allah, and due to this, he was called Dawood. And you are protected from this injury, so you are called Surima. What the heck? And if you don't believe me, I will give you the link. So you can tell all the scientists in the world the clear evidence of the big bang it's there if this is not the big bang in every brain what is the big bang then guys did you notice something fakira is not trying to call no more usually she make always like a new names big names after the spanking she is so sorry She give up. How this is against Christianity? I don't know, David. I don't know. Well, who talking about Christianity now? It, what what Christianity? So, Mister David, do you agree that the gold grow in the valley of the ants, David? And do you agree that Suleiman he have a flying carpet? Or maybe he, you are copying the true Muslim Muhammadan? Muslim Muhammadan saying, What are you saying is against Christianity? <laughs> Why uh, uh, true Muhammadan? In Christianity, it says that gold grow in the valley of the ants. Can you give me the reference? I'm waiting. I mean, Muslims, they have a comment. It's beyond ant imagination. <laughs> I mean, you have to be an ant to understand what ant is saying. And the same for Muhammadan. You have to be a Muhammadan to understand what Muhammadan says because only Allah knows what Muhammadan mean. CP, what are you saying is against Christianity? <clears throat> he knew it from Muhammadan. Why you don't go and do Hajj to the Valley of the Ant instead of going to Mecca? At least you'll get some gold when you come back. And maybe you can have an interview posted in Twitter or in Google with the ant, <clears throat> don't you think this ant is blessed by Allah still alive? Or maybe you can speak to her ancestors, grand, 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 granddaughters. One of the funny things the Muslim they claim that the Quran said that the one who mentioned in the Quran it says Namla, Namla, and the article saying, according to the discovery of science. The guardian ant is a female. Ha 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 ha. I'm losing my voice. But Abdul, in Arabic, Namla is the only word we have. 
to every single ant. It's not about the gender. We don't check their balls. It's an ant, you idiot. So every single ant, we call it namla. Namil is a group of ants. <clears throat> I mean, they are desperate to find anything in the Quran to make it a miracle. So now they come, they say, okay, why it says namla as a female and not male? We don't have male ant in Arabic. We don't. Same for a fly, Dubaba. We don't have a male fly. Those are insects, you donkey. So they are desperate. And then they say, oh, it doesn't say just an ant. It says female ant in Arabic. It's crazy people. And you know, <clears throat> if you don't speak Arabic, they can fool you with this. They can say, oh, you know, really it says that, you know? Well, uh, okay. And say I discovered that. Mm. And then Suleiman, I mean, the story keep coming, you know. And you'll notice, by the way, here in the Quran, Suleiman is happy, he smiled. But in the story there, Suleiman is upset. Because he said to her, why you are scaring people with me? Don't you know I am just prophet of Allah? Here he's smiling. <clears throat> and then Suleiman, he checked the birds. The story of the birds is a different story. You are a king who have an army, and his army is made of genie and birds and human. What a nice army. Please don't report to Putin. He is hiring Wagner because he's short of army. Now he will know about it. He will start hiring genie and chickens. And then they will start throwing their eggs at the Ukrainian. An army of birds? This is the same book speaking about the Big Bang. Suleiman, he have an army of birds and genie. <clears throat> and what make it more funny, the verse before it says, that Allah, he taught Suleiman the language of the birds, yet, yet he understand the ants. <laughs> I mean, how stupid can be to rule, to, 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 be, to be Allah? So you taught the guy the language of the birds. Why did not teach Muhammad even Arabic? According to Muslims, Muhammad did not know how to read, how to write. Suleiman, not only he knew how to write, how to read, now he knew even languages of birds. Suleiman, go to the chicken. Chicken answer. The rooster, he gets involved. He says, bark, 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 bark. Suleiman, he come backward and he give them orders. Bark, 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 bark. Which means like, go to war now. Don't waste your time. I hope my translation is coming accurate because I'm not too much familiar with the, with the language of Lili Dawa. And this is Quran. And this is the book which nobody can write like, can you write like this? Let us be honest. Who can write a book like this? Nobody. How many people are in the chat from Indonesia? Give me one. Because I want to know where is the Indonesian shakes? How come there's a lot of Indonesian people here, yet not even one Ustad there to call me? How many from Indonesia we have here? I'm the only Indonesian here? What the heck? Okay, here we go. I will give one. That's just to support myself. I don't I don't feel I don't like to be alone, the only Indonesian here. Okay, so we have many Indonesian here. Where is the Ustad? Hmm? 
Hey, Indonesian Muslims, where is the Ustad? Where is your Sheikh? Why the left alone? Don't you see what's happening? Don't you see the avalanche? Aren't you aware of the disaster happening around the world? Do something, say something, bring something. And listen to something. Assalamu alaikum. My heart is breaking. Oh, brothers and sisters, my soul is aching. Brothers and sisters, did you know that so many people are leaving Islam every day? Why would anybody leave such a beautiful religion? Why would they choose to become a sick disbeliever instead? A'udhu Billah. Brothers and sisters, 100,000 Muslims are leaving Islam every single year. Over 100,000 Muslims leave Islam every single year. I'm telling you, this is serious stuff. This is not a joke. This is not a joke, brothers and sisters. Yes, we say that there are 1.6 billion Muslims in the world and Islam is growing day by day. But the standard narrative has holes. And we are not proud of that. And we're not proud of that. Apostates are everywhere. They are among us. They are even people who memorize the Quran. They are copies of the Quran. The youth are full of doubts. Our youth are full of doubts. And we tell them, doubts? What doubts, man? Doubts? What doubts, man? Have some guts, be a man. Have some guts, be a man. But nobody is answering their questions. And nobody's answering their questions. We tell them to stop questioning and to stop being emotional. And we tell them to be a Chad. Be a Chad. You can do it. I believe in you. But instead, they choose to be bad. We've seen this happen, unfortunately. We've seen this happen to a lot of people. If it continues like this, your child is going to become an apostate. Your, your child is going to become an apostate. Imagine your child, your child, the child that you are raising could end up with the disbelievers, with the kuffar and go to hellfire. Hellfire will want to swallow them. Hellfire will roast them. Roast them. Toast them. Toast them. Break them. Break them. Shake them. Shake them. Hellfire. Hellfire will annihilate them. Will annihilate them. And the rest of us will be watching. Will be watching. Brothers and sisters, we must act now. We must do something about this. And what you can do is to donate to our channel so that we can do something. May Allah keep us firm. Never let us go astray. May Allah keep our children firm. If we don't take constructive steps now, this is going to become an avalanche. It is going to become an avalanche. A tsunami. A tsunami. The apostates, they are everywhere. They don't make it public. They hide it. They are leading prayers. They are leading prayers the Muslim. They are still living the life of a religious Muslim. And they are still leading that life while simultaneously declaring their apostates. Brothers and sisters, if you feel as strongly about this as I do, then please donate to us and our cause. You can make a one-time donation or a monthly donation. Please be generous. Please give whatever you can so that we can take the responsibility and alhamdulillah spread apostasy. Donate now. Help now. You may even receive many gifts in heaven, in paradise, in Jannah. You can get a house next to me or next to some other very good looking man. <laughs> you have an opportunity right now on this Haram New Year. You can do something halal and donate your money to us. So what are you waiting for? Donate now. Leave it to Sheikh Abudi. Alhamdulillah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Donate immediately, please, because by donation, you can stop the apostasy. And this is the whole idea of those Muslims making those videos to get money. But yet, they can't answer any question. Donate right now. Brothers and sisters, 100,000, this is only in USA. But if you think about it, in USA, the Muslim number is so small. So if every year 100,000 Muslims leave in USA alone, in USA alone, then in how many years there is no Muslim will be left in USA? Donate right now. They cannot refute us. They cannot help your kids. Because in order to help their kids who they are apostate, will you have to answer them? <clears throat> Oh boy, do we have any Muhammadan? Anyone? When they asked Zakir Naik about the Big Bang, 
and we show you the, the, the video. He did not answer. He said, uh, the Quran says six days. He said, Brother Thither, the Quran is not saying six days. He meant six period. <clears throat> I guess I have to go before my voice is totally gone. Hmm. Do we have any Muhammadan? <clears throat> Listen, I'm tired. My voice is tired. Now you can win. You can donate falafel, don't worry. Muslims, they accept anything. Even kingdoms. <laughs> you can give your daughter. You know? Aisha, she said, that because she was jealous, she said, isn't it women is ashamed to offer herself to the Prophet to F her? Because she is jealous, not because her husband is a is a fraud. How a woman she would offer herself to a prophet? How? Aisha she said to herself. Aren't they ashamed? Hmm? There is no sin if they offer themselves. It's only privilege for you, Muhammad. Look how decent he is. Aisha, she is standing, and there is women. They come into Muhammad. Take me, baby. Baby Muhammad, take me to bed right now, please. I want to offer myself to the Prophet so I can serve Allah. Can you tell me what is the relationship between women opening their legs, excuse me, and serving Allah religion. Any Muhammadan, he can tell me what is the point of this. Allah commanding Muslim women to open their legs to Muhammad. And this is a privilege only for Muhammad. How and why this happening? How you can serve the purpose of God by taking off your panty to Muhammad? A Muslim, he gave us an answer. Thank you. Finally, a Muslim, he gave an answer equal to 1,000 picture. I'm telling you, only Muslims, they can come with such answers. People don't believe me. The Prophet, he had to grow a family. What? It was a family reason. Let us be honest. Isn't it, isn't it this is the answer can silence anyone? Hey, but Abdul, your prophet have already 13 with wives and he have hundreds of sex slaves. So what family we are talking about? Huh? And none of them can have kids because he cannot have kids because his penis is not functioning. But your answer is a gold. Your answer remind me of the gold grow in the valley of the ant. Be honest with me, brother. Where do you grow your answers? Like, did you buy seeds from Walmart or they are seedless? The prophet was growing a family? That's deep. I like to grow family too. Any Muslim women who want to offer herself to Christian brands? Because I want to grow family. Many family. Who want to offer herself to Prophet Muhammad the Prince? And listen carefully. I'm not interested in sexual anything. No. I'm interested in family. I have only 13 wives, which means I'm still single and ready to mingle. 
and now I want to decide today I want to grow family because the first the first 13 wives they don't count growing family happened after the first 14 and 15 and 16 and 17 and do you see the answers? Muhammad is a growing family. Mm. I am not a prophet. You are not illiterate. What are you talking about? I am illiterate. Don't you see how I read English? Okay, hold on, hold on. I want to prove to you that I am illiterate. Hmm. This is the Quran. Huh? Be my witness, be my witness. Okay. And now I will go to Bahasa Indonesian. Hmm. You tell me what I'm saying. Only Allah knows what I'm reading. Look. Dan Suleiman, Tela, Marawasi, Dawood, Dan Dia Barakata, Hai Mahmunusa, Kimi Telha, Dibri, Benegration. Tananga, tan, 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 is that like tan, tan, something? Tan, 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 uh, <clears throat> I know it, I know it, but you know, I was just, uh, you know, being funny, like, come on, I speak very well, you know, tan, 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 like ten tanks, put them together, not eleven, ten tanks. Sawura, Borong, Dankami, Dibri. Uh, this is the same debris he mentioned before, but this is her sister because debris is already mentioned. If you remember, you know, uh, you know, if you go down here, it says uh, debris here and debris here. But this debris is not the same as the first debris. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm telling you, I'm the smartest between all the unbelievable. Okay, anyway, see, yeah. A gala. Ah, this is Seagal, the guy who went to uh, Russia and, uh, you know, he's a womanizer, he, an, an American actor, he played karate, it's funny, and uh, Putin, he gave him Seagal, okay. Sasutu, and this is the guy in the cartoon, Sasuke, you know, and hey, Bazaran, Sasuke, cartoon. Sasutu, Sisanaguna Guhanaya. Yeah, like this is from like honey, you know? Okay. Sisuma, this is sesame, sesame seed. Ini Banar, Banar. Like you know, two banar, two banar banar, you know. In Indonesian, like if you wanna, you wanna, you say too many, so you repeat the word like twice. Like so, let us say we have too many idiots in USA. So what we say, Biden, Biden, <laughs> unbelievable. That's good. All right, Satu Korania Young. Uh, that's me, Young. It's talking about Young. I mean, how in the world the Quran knew my age? I can't believe it. That's beyond. I'm I'm re I'm shocked. I, I, I'm going. I have a reaction now. <laughs> reaction. Then diarrhea. No, not diarrhea. Hold on. Dihi mu bu kan otuk otuk Suleiman. You know what I don't like about Suleiman that he have a lot of otuk. You know, so. Uh, like uh, you know him, you know I took. I, I I think it's clear now. Like you know, I explain it to you. <laughs> you know, I mean, you have to be very like weird that to understand what I'm saying. I mean, it's so clear. It says untook, untook, untook. He did not take it. <laughs> and uh, and took. Why you are stuck with it? It's easy. Okay. Tintaranaya diri jin. You know, jin, here we go. We know we know what that means. <laughs> I know, I many of you are very good. I mean, you are amazed, like, you know, your kids now, they will say, how oh, dad, how come you can't speak in Indonesian like Christian prince? And then you will be ashamed, like, you know, son, what I don't know. You know, that's, uh, please forgive me, you know, I don't mean it. Uh, maybe the food I'm eating, maybe your mom, she is not doing breastfeeding for adult for me. Maybe you should convince your mom to give me breastfeeding for adult from time to time so I can get more vitamin, you know, the same Prophet Muhammad said, there's a 10 time breastfeeding for adult and the women these days are not doing it. So it's time to make a revolution. Hey Muslims, 
a prophet, he ordered Muslim women to give 10 time breast feeding for adult for a person who is not the husband. I want to be a Muslim. Now, I'm hungry. I did not eat my lunch yet. At least no milk was in my lunch. Now I know why they call it the Milky Way. I think they were talking about Islam. It's a way full of women with the breast. Milky Way. And the breasts are dripping milk. Adult feeding. Like you go in the highway of the Milky Way. Honey, who wants some milk? Stop here. And you cannot, by the way, you cannot shake hands with those women. But you can suck their boobs and play with it. Because it's haram to shake hands. But it's halal to sit in their lap and suck their nipples. Hmm. Do we have any Muhammadan? You tell me if I'm lying. Anyone? Don't forget to click at the link in the top later and share the, the video of our brother. You know, I asked many people to make short videos. Nobody did it except this person. So thank you. Short video, Lili Dawa, refuting Lili Dawa. Let everybody laugh at him. Where do you sing up, CP? What does that mean? Sing up? There's sing down and sing up? I mean, you know what? English is really funny. When you sing up, huh? I'm looking up now. It is sing down. Any Muhammadan? Any proud Muhammadan? Any Indonesian Muhammadan? Sing sound like sin. Sound like Chinese for me. Sing song. Sing song. Sing sound like sin. You know, when I went to China, I was really shocked. Everybody there is Chinese. Nobody there except the Chinese. The Chinese are building their country. The Americans are busy with the transgender. Who is the smarter? You tell me. Hmm.